The next important piece is closing the gap. When, when the whistle blows, we shake hands and start wrestling. Uh, my position is critical in how I close this distance between my opponent and myself. Um, I think it's very important that we hold our fundamental position, but as we close the gap, I make initial contact with my head. I keep my arms relaxed here. They're both offensive, but I don't want to reach. A lot of times, this, this is a habit. This is, makes us feel secure, and I think we're far better by just kind of stopping forward and making contact with our head. Okay? I'm keeping all the other aspects in line, uh, elevation and angle. My arms are relaxed, and I'm moving forward into my opponent, and making initial contact with my head. A lot of times this will force his reaction. Here I move forward to an angle. If he starts putting hands on me, then I can engage with my hands. But making, forward, making initial contact with my head, so my hands are here. My hands are here relaxed. If he does decide to shoot on me or attack, I'm in position. Again, I have offensive priority, but I have defensive capability. Moving forward here, making contact. Even if I'm a no tie type wrestler, I move forward in this way where I can look for my offense when it's touch and go or pump fakes. But again, I'm in a position where I'm offensive and really invulnerable defensively. 